And a major move in Richmond. Legislators avoided an all-out battle when it comes to the state budget. Instead, lawmakers agreed to a special session in May to give time to both sides for new negotiations. Emily Harrison is in the studio now. And Emily, this isn't the only major decision to come out of the General Assembly today. Not by a long shot. Governor Glenn Youngkin sent dozens of amended bills back to the General Assembly on topics ranging from re-legalizing skill games to Virginia Beach's 10-1 voting system. And one by one, state lawmakers either accepted the governor's amendments or rejected them. The only notable compromise to really happen today is the state budget. In the House of Delegates, lawmakers unanimously rejected the governor's 233 amendments to the state budget. According to the Office of the Speaker, top Democrats like Louise Lucas and Republican leaders like Todd Gilbert met Tuesday night to strike a deal postponing budget negotiations. It's a move top leaders say lawmakers made to reduce some of the tension surrounding the budget. And yes, to compromise and to find common ground. Raise the minimum wage. We gave teachers a pay raise. We expanded access to health care and education. Other bills did not get the same treatment. Virginia Beach Senators Aaron Rouse and Bill DeSteff went toe-to-toe -to -toe over Virginia Beach's 10-1 voting system. Governor Glenn Youngkin amended the bill to postpone adding the voting system into the city's charter because of ongoing lawsuits. One of the frivolous lawsuits that was filed that my uh, uh, the senator from Virginia Beach was speaking to was already thrown out. Whether the lawsuits are frivolous or not, it's longstanding tradition that we typically do not um, pass laws regarding that. Senators voted to reject the governor's amendments and again rejected changes made to re-legalizing skill games. Senator Rouse said the governor's amendments effectively ban skill games. The 35-mile radius around gaming establishment alone wipes out the entire Hampton Roads area. The 2,500-foot radius around schools, daycare, and churches takes out the rest of the state. Now, Virginia senators stopped short of voting to repass the skill games bill that initially went to the governor's desk. However, more discussions on this bill and what will happen to the state budget are expected. Emily Harrison, 13 News Now. All right, Emily, thank you. And lawmakers have until June 30th to come to an agreement about the state budget. Again, that special session is scheduled to happen in May.